Good morning, gamers. Today, we are playing Highlander Rogue in this paladin infested ladder we know as hell. Uh, I'm really excited to see where this deck actually lines up against that matchup. But I don't know. I saw this list on uh, the donkey site, which is like right here. If you don't know what it is, highly recommend going to it because it's um, it's a good way of getting some deck lists. Uh, it looks really fun. So we're going to get right into it. But most importantly, we're going to talk about how this expansion has been shaping up. See, normally when rotation happens, I am really looking forward to playing Hearthstone. It's my favorite time of the year for Hearthstone. I absolutely love it. I'm sure a lot of people feel the exact same way because generally speaking, rotation is when Hearthstone is the most popular. But I, I don't know how this expansion is really shaping up for a lot of people. I'm a little worried that it's not doing a great job of getting people excited for rotation just because of how oppressive Paladin is. I do know that they won't like I don't know when they're going to do it, but for sure they will nerf something up and coming. It, it'll be a question of whether or not they do it quickly. I hope they do it sooner rather than later. Also, I've never played this deck before, so let's see how this goes. We're going in Shaman. Shaman is Highlander or nature as far as I'm concerned, but I don't care what they're doing because I only played this game like solitaire ish. So let's keep the Cobalt Miner and we'll go from there. Yeah, so I, I hope they nerf stuff soon. It, it, it'll be a little bit sad if this expansion is kind of like mid, uh, the excitement of the expansion is like mitigated because, you know, they let Paladin be Paladin for too long. Speaker Stomper is pretty good, but I, I don't need it right now, obviously, and I can't play it. That's a good card. You have this on too. Not too worried. Uh, basically, the only card we're really looking for is Reno. I'm not even sure Tess is in this deck, to be honest with you. Um, it'll be really interesting to see if it is. Also, if you're curious, for people who are very like observant, I now have three monitors rather than two. I've had two monitors for so long, and the change from two monitors to three monitors is very nice. It's it's like a whole new world has opened up, and I'm such a big fan of it. Dude, this guy's drawing more cards than I have the entire game so far. My God, I'm going to win in fatigue. <laughs> no, you fucking bitch. I hate when this guy comes in my hand and I can't play with him. Uh, We're going to trade this. Probably going to have to rock that. Mmm, this is Zilliax. When I copied this deck code, I didn't know what Zilliax to make because the Zilliax didn't copy. So I went with this one. I feel like the cost one less for each minion in play is really good. And because there's a lot of decks that just kind of flood the board, I feel like, oh, like, yeah, if I can get a free Zilliax or a two cost Zilliax, that's the one to get. Not sure if that's correct. I I feel like I'm going to lose this game. Is this just what's going to happen today? Hmm. You're drawing a lot of cards. <laughs> uh, that's, that's almost too many cards for me, man. I'm, I'm, I'm probably dead, right? Like I, I have no way to out or out heal their damage and I'm at 30 life. I would have to discover a card that gives me armor. So maybe from like Velarock, it actually helps me out. But I have no way of generating a card from a different class to transform this beautiful bastard into a dragon. I really like the. Oh, that's kind of nice. I was going to say like. It's good that they use burn on my uh, my minion rather than my face and my Zilliax is cheaper. Wait, is that good? Is there any way I can manipulate this to get to one mana? I don't think so. I can play this and then this is free and that's probably the best case scenario because then I get Sonya for again. I'm kind of for that. Actually, I could go. No, I'm, I was. It's too close. It's too close. This gives me the life back anyway. So the damage he just did was basically irrelevant. Now, the question is, how do I die? I actually haven't gone against this nature shaman deck once. So I'm really nervous to see how this pans out. Please don't kill me, man. Oh, it's so crazy, dude. The lethality in this expansion is absolutely wild just comparatively to like almost everything else. Yeah, yeah, do that. So you lose the snake oil. That's big. Shout out to my coffee drinkers. It's 935 in the morning as I'm recording this and this coffee's hitting. Oh. There's a chance. I mean, it doesn't full clear if it would kill that, please. Hello? Okay. Best case. Actually, just best case. Okay. I mean, they are overloaded, which is nice. Um, I don't think the Sonya interaction works, right? Could be wrong. We can go this into this, and I can get two elementals, and that sounds really exciting. We we'll get some big boys here. I mean, we're... Listen. I'm in Diamond 5 MMR. Let's be real here. After the Whizbang, like trying to get legend with it, I'm sure my MMR dropped like an absolute shit ton. 
So I, I'm hoping I'm not going against like the best players in the world. Yeah, so I'm kind of about this. This, this, this. Uh, that guy's big, so let's pick that guy. <laughs> and then we get to do it again. That's exciting. Uh, that guy's also big, so that's exciting. Okay, so if I play this guy, is there any way for me to get like another discount here? It doesn't look like it, but I could actually go for the glowing glyph and just stop this. I'm actually okay with just freezing this. Then we can go phase here. It's a lot of surprising damage. I don't think they were expecting. Oh, this guy's also free. I forgot. Nice. Yeah, I know people are going to be like, ha, rare and really like Sonya, but this is a really fun card. I'm going to be real with you. I really like the design because the design feels like you, um, you have to play around it and it can be very powerful if you do play around it. Okay. Am I just dead next turn? I'm a bit scared. I should play this. Maybe I should have played this instead. Because this is... Actually, I don't know if this count. It counts as a row card though, right? Is there any way for lethal here? I don't think so. I'm going to test it because it might count, but I'm not sure. No, it does not. I, I knew that. It's like this sets me up in the best case possible. Um, oh. Hearthstone lagged hard there. All right, I almost killed him. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna die here over scared too, right? Which is a bit depressing. Damn, I just never had a way to actually proc this. Who built this deck? This deck sucks. I didn't build this deck. That's why I'm saying that. I'm kidding. The person who built this is obviously a genius. It's just unfortunate I'm going into this. Am I really dead? It's turn seven. Three mana? I guess a lot of them. It, it seems unlikely, but what do I know? Okay. There's no way. No way. Okay, I'm done. Really? Really? No way. Oh, I'm done. I'm not. And we have lethal. Let's go. Easy. Wasn't worried at all. Absolutely wasn't worried at all. That was so free. Eat shit. Let's go. Dude, I want to make that. That is crazy to me. Dude, combo decks used to take so long to get going. And it was like really telegraphed when they were going to start doing their combo. The only telegraph I had there was they use force of lightning or whatever the card is that like discounts their nature spells and he kind of just popped off after i feel like um that's a little too spicy for my taste i don't like dying from hand on turn seven all that guy did was draw that's crazy to me all right this should be a really fun matchup because at least warrior is not going directly for the throat big fan of that rating party is also great um we can keep the one hit wonder but i don't think it's really needed it's absolute man Oh, you guys are good. I, it's, but the Hearthstone boomer in me just thinks of like freeze mage and it took like so long to actually get your combo. Then you have to think you have to think about like, can I Alex now or can I ice block right now? It's just a different time, bro. Hmm. That's a bit unfortunate. We didn't get a pirate, but yeah, I mean, that's the problem with playing Highlander, right? It's very inconsistent. So we'll take what we can get at least. This is, this could be a really good card if we get some spice. All right. Excavating is fine. Um. I could go Quinn Raiding Party, but I'm not against doing this. I feel like the, the Azerite Snake is going to be a huge part of the win condition here. I really hope Tess is in this deck, but I have no idea. And that's half the fun without a deck tracker, right? Like, if I was truly trying to climb... Wait, this card's in standard? Well, I'm just learning something new. <laughs> All right, let's do that. You drop that's good? I mean, that's good. Oh, I forgot I have an excavated first. I always forget that um, this doesn't count as an excavate until the death rattle procs. That was actually probably best case, I think, for the rock to deal with that. Ooh. Character artists. Mm, don't really need that. I do want to proc this first. I could go for the raiding party, and I think that's actually fine. Let's just see what we grab. The buccaneer boy and the quick pick. All right, let's um, gonna hit this. Because we can probably kill it with this. Let's just see what we grab it fast. Canary. Okay. Could be good. Canary could be spicy. Yeah, it's, it's just weird thinking about like how far OTK decks have come. And then I think about like 
even a little bit later on like what was an otk deck there was grim page i guess grim page was pretty spicy but it did take a lot of time for it to be good okay death in here is insane but i actually am just gonna canary this actually i might go pirate them i'm gonna canary i'm zoom mini bounces this back up this guy's upset because he didn't get his odin draw not my fault i don't know what to tell you <laughs> Dude, what is what is this card in my deck for? I don't understand. I gotta go look at the list and see it. I guess it literally is just the oh, that's bad. Um, I'm glad I kept the deafen, I guess. At least we can deal with one. Break dance. Hmm. I'm a bit scared here. What's in this? Ooh. Very good card. Get that guy in play. That's I could kill both right now. Do I want to kill both right now? Is it really needed? I kind of just want to silence this because I mean, going coin into Reno seems like a pretty good idea. Mm -hmm. I could actually just do it right now, though, and kill it. And then we could just go coin in Reno depending on what they play. I'm not against it. I feel like I don't want to take damage if I can avoid it. I, I feel like it's a bit cringe though, because if he does end up playing like Odin, it's going to suck. So maybe I hold the Reno for one extra turn. That's probably what I'm going to have to do. I mean, I'm going to play that. He's clearly looking for his Odin. So I'm, oh, what the hell? I just realized that bouncing it back to his hand got rid of the mustache. Cat jumped on my desk. Yeah, I'm, I'm about this. Oh, ah, Mooney. Thanks. I'm basically just saying you're not allowed to draw Odin. That's the only thing I care about. Now, if they do top deck it, I'm going to be very upset. Or if they had it in hand, this whole play is miserable, but at least I get to trade it. What's that? Slam. Poetry. Dude, look at my cat. Look at my cat. She's so rattled. She's like, I wanted to go on top of the table. Oh, never mind. She's, she's fine, though. No. She's like, I wanted to go on top of the table, you idiots. I think I played this deck fall flawlessly. This matchup, at least dealing with the, the tail. I also got really lucky with the canary and my Velarock is just chilling. Okay. Infinite cards. What is that? ETC. Yeah, I don't even know what's in it. So let's see. <laughs> what do we got here? A Viper breakdance could be good. I actually don't mind the Viper pick here. All right, uh, let's trade this Pit stop. It'd be good for Zilliax. I'm just going to draw, I think. Ooh, Ultron Prime is really interesting. This card's really, this card's like probably the strangest Titan out of all of them. I feel like it, it does have a use case, but does it really have a use case? That's unfortunate. Oh my, wait. Okay. I was going to be like, huh? That didn't seem like a good idea. Ooh. Okay, Pirate Boy's back. Let's see what's in this box real fast. So this is Drilly the Kid or this. I obviously probably pick that just because uh, I do want to get the, the the Hawk out as soon as possible. That's also just really good. I am about going face. I also don't want to trade because this will give a mini. Uh, this will give a card back in my hand. We'll, we'll keep the weapon for the time being. I don't even know if there's another weapon in here. Sorry, when I'm at trade, I mean like attack with my weapon. Do they have Odin yet? They do not. Oh, this is the Tendril deck. I forgot Warrior's Wind Condition is now different. It's no longer about Odin spiciness. Ooh, that's not good. Mm. The good news is that when he dies, these will be discounted by five, right? Which is kind of spicy. Remember when this card sucked? <laughs> oh. Wow. Yeah, more? Yes, you do. Oh, oh, yo, relax. Oh, my God, and he got rid. I guess the, the, the symphony was really good for him because it stopped him from burning all these random ass cards. Now he's nervous. Now he's like, oh, shit, I'm going to die. <laughs> Big agree, buddy. Holy moly, tendril surprise over this crazy. Shadow stuff. Okay. Fortunately for me, this is kind of weird. Mm, how do we do this? Uh, Rin's not really a problem for me. I don't really care. I need to just get some cards out of my hand. 
Uh, do I want to play Voltron here? Voltron seems a little strange, but I, I think I'm okay with playing this because we could just shadow step it. Oh, that's not bad. Yeah, we could do um, this, reduce, and then shadow step this. This is active too, which is cool. Play this. Play this. Okay. Mm -hmm. I don't really care what, what burns, I guess. That kind of sucks. I lost my Valorock, which is absolutely hysterical. And I lost my... Oh my god, it's a travesty. I'm going to execute this because I feel like the other one's better. I, I kind of want to bounce that back to my hand, but I think Rin actually... Yeah, Rin took my break dance. And it took my Velarock. Am I just going to die here? I don't know what's happening anymore. If I could flick actually one of their tendrils, that would be like best case scenario. That card's really good to get. Okay. I mean, he will get the 10 here, right? I need him to play one at least. If they could play one, that'd be really nice. But not like, don't do too many. Don't do too many, please. Just one would be great. Okay, so this will go seven, eight. I think I'd lose here. Oh, God. Oh, that's not good. Oh, God. We get 910 here. What is that? Frostbolt, my face is rude. Also rude. This is 10. I think I lose this game. Huh? Yeah, I think this game's over, boys. Unless hold on. I have a uh, five, seven, well, no, five, eight. Well, sorry, what am I even saying here? I have a uh, eight from, or five from this. Kill this, kill both of these. I could do, I can't attack face though. Okay, I'm gonna die next turn. Okay, give me something amazing. That's not what I needed, unfortunately. Hmm. This saves me from doing the flick, I guess, so we can pick that. But I don't know if I ever get lethal here is my problem. Oh, Sonny has one off and I don't have the mana for it, unfortunately. Yeah, I think I'm dead, unfortunately, just because um, if I got to if he didn't freeze my face, he frostbolted in my face. That was so random. Damn it, man. Yeah. You know, what's crazy. If I just swung face the one turn where I didn't want to swing my weapon at his minion, I would have won that game. That's wild. Ah, it sucks. That's a crazy win condition. So I'm, I was playing around Odin rather than playing for the tendrils. I have to remember that the tendrils are the win condition now rather than anything else, which is, a, it was just, I guess, a, a more interesting way of dying to just Odin over and over again. I'm not sure which one's more popular. You know what? Let's go take a peek. Sees. Which one is more popular in terms of meta? Troll Warrior still seems popular with Odin. I guess maybe they just run both. You're close, though. This looks like a bot. All my opponents are bots, though. I'm going to keep the rating part. I might coin into it. I just don't really want to see plagues. I do find it really interesting that they didn't make a card to counter the plagues. You know, like, I feel like it would have been nice to have. This is a really good hand for the record because this on two is great. And then if I really want to, I can go in into the Sonya. Okay. I'm not sure what this is. This could be plague. This could be a rainbow. They're both like good in their own way. Mm hmm. I'm going to shadow step this. The reason I'm going to shadow step this is because I'm going to go raiding party into hopefully draw the excavate weapon here. And if I don't draw the excavate weapon, I'm going to be a little upset. Just a tad. Nothing too major here. I think this is the longest. I've, actually, to be fair, I was going to say like this might be the longest I've been diamond, but I, I didn't play standard for like a month and a half before this expansion came out. Give me the good weapon, please. I beg you. I beg you. I love you. I love you. You're my favorite. Yes. Okay, I'm okay burning a card. What am I really needing? Next turn, I want to go like this. Mm, maybe I should coin rock and then just like delay it for one turn. It's a little greedy. It makes me a little upset because that means I'm one turn off. One more turn off from Reno because like, oh, he's going coin for Reno. Also, I should really craft this card golden because it's, it's going to be like playable throughout this entire year guaranteed. And then also... Um, if they had to nerfing it, I'm chilling. 
And they surely will never nerf it, right? Break dance. Yeah, I'm kind of okay with this. Oh, it's a combo. <laughs> <laughs> I, bro, I was looking at that like something doesn't sound right about something. Something doesn't seem right about this. And now I understand why. It's really funny. Ow. I got to bounce that card back up, right? I do want to play this, though. How much do I care about this? Because if I do this right now, I could just play Canary again. And then next turn for six, this goes to five and I can Reno. I think that's the play. I'm going to be real. This card is really good. Like, it's surprising how strong this card really is. I, I would be... I feel like this is almost like an auto include in like every single every single rogue deck for the rest of the time. Like I feel like it's just really, really good until it rotates. It's here for the next two years though. It's just such a powerful effect. Okay, so this is a Highlander. Um I am gonna go Reno here. I think it's just fine. Limits their board next turn. <laughs> and then we can go for the excavate plan after. Also, there's a chance that they don't kill this and I can breakdance it with uh, Sonya. They'll like um, breakdance this, play this, get another one. Let me pop off. I mean, okay, it's going to die. <laughs> okay, it's fine. <laughs> you have the other one. Yes, bro. Voltron Prime. Do I really want to do this? How much do I care about them gaining life? I don't think I care at all. I'm a little baby about it. This is after yeah. that one damage in. Okay, uh, so we need to break this weapon, which I can right now to get the hawk. If I get the hawk right now, is that good? I could obviously do this. Um, let's do this for sure. The hawk is fine. It gets rid of a card in my hand. The, the only issue is like I can't keep Sonya, and I would like to keep Sonya because she's kind of nuts. But like I don't really care. I think having the hawk is better. I want to break dance the hawk, so let's do this. And my mana here. Is, uh, next year we can do this and this, and then break dance it. I don't really care about their life, right? I'm still laughing about the pirate play, bro. That's so funny. Every time I play it, it's always been comboed. I guess I just never paid attention to it. Oof, that guy's kind of big. Not a fan of that. Let's do this though. After you play a coin. Swap attack with another mini. I mean, that's pretty good. You know, um, I will be frogging it today. And then we will be break we'll be break dancing this for sure. And I can kill mom paw here. Ooh, void shirt's also good. No, but I, I definitely want to do this, right? I'm okay with burning a card. There's no card I really care about in my deck. Other than maybe like Bellarock, but I feel like keeping this in my hands really strong stop that from happening and obviously we don't want to swing what is this at the end of your turn summon a random six cost mini in that last three turns that's pretty good nice okay i feel like we got this in the bag fetch is fine too i think this thing is just says draw a minion i don't even know if i have a beast in this deck also what is with this card i feel like i've been seeing this card a ton three mana two three poisonous and then it just draws a rush mini. i feel like it's the equivalent of the uh the scorpion from forge and the barons like um who really like just poisonous minions for three costs. Now, obviously it's a little different because one of them discovered a spell going when didn't, but you get what I'm saying. You primacing here. Really? Interesting. Maybe it's a flick angle here. I feel like they're going to trade here. I'm actually really okay with flicking this. I don't really know what else I want to flick. That's definitely a consideration though. Primus is, I think, scarier, though. I, I, I don't know. Um, I could do this. This becomes, like, I, I like this. Let's do this. Also makes this cheaper, which is nice. This. Do this. Do this. To play this. And then we can also draw a card here. There's my boy Flint. We got a nice six cost boy, which is a shitter, but it's fine. This is kind of spicy. I, I don't know how, how do you guys feel about auras. I feel like auras are really like cool. They, they're they kind of, they're kind of, one of them is kind of broken, but <laughs> that's all right. But just go for the face. I feel like this is going to be a clear then. Yeah, they're going to go for the gnome card here. Oh, never, never mind. Let's go. Huge. 
Oh. Sure. I haven't seen them excavate once, though. I don't know why they're doing this. Feels a little weak, doesn't it? Especially if you might get the 1-1. One, one. Yeah, I don't know about that play, Mr. I don't know who the fuck this is, but it's a little strange, a little strange. Got pretty bad play overall. So we could do this and then into the Zilliax. Which I think is very fun. Uh, what do these do again? <laughs> Let's kill that, obviously. I actually, okay, low key, I think this card's broken. Oh, damn, more lifesteal. I feel like I'm in a really good spot here, by the way, but um, this uh, this sickly Grime Walker card is nutty. Okay, big 10-10 boy and not even worried about it. Yeah, yeah, that's fine, that's fine. All right, bitch, what do we got? Um, This is really good on uh, just like the life. Life is nice. And then the Titan Leaf. Oh my God. Let's do um maybe this. Nice. <laughs> I'll, I just want him to go on the fucking zilly accent. It's just not working here. Let's do this. Uh these are really bad. I don't want to do these. Okay. Unfortunately for me. Maybe this no this. I could have done this first. But I already knew it was gonna buff this. Do I care about them drawing cards? Maybe slightly actually. Ooh, I didn't think about that. Let's do this first then. Not really. Actually, I don't mind them drawing cards, right? Because the team might be relevant, and I feel like I'm in a good enough spot where this is completely okay. It's all intentional. It's all intentional. Mm, can't play that card. That card sucks. Let's play, uh, I guess we'll play you. And we'll just pass the turn. I'm sure they have some kind of board clear, right? Like, uh, do, am I playing on the 10 cost spell here? I guess I am. I think spell could be a big deal. Ah, see there, there's the other one into the card, right? What? Where's the gnome card, bro? The four boys who come out of nowhere and absolutely rail me. Okay. That's not, that's not getting railed. Oh. I'm getting railed. That's a one, two rail right there. This card's still alive, which is good. Don't kill that. You can't, you won't. Nice. Wait. The face. I guess I can kill it, which is good. That's that's probably the. I could go for the way I can steal it and then he's tilted off the face of the planet, right? That's just the play. That's 100% the play, but I kind of want to make him draw more cards, so I'm going to make him do that instead. Um, this hmm, fire, sure. And this one's going to go here. I'm going to keep this alive uh, for the time being, right? We could do this. And we can do this into this, draw more stuff. Big, big stuff guy right here. Uh, sure. Uh, yeah, why not? Uh, we can do this. Um, I mean, that's not really relevant, but I'm going to play it anyways. And then sure, well, at this point, we might as well just hit that, right? I, I don't know if playing for fatigue is correct, but we do have Yogg, so I'm not the most worried. I probably shouldn't have played for fatigue. I, if I lose this game, it's because I gave him resources, right? That's okay. Mm. Yes. I might actually steal that unironically. Oh, they left this lit. It lived? Wait, this living is good because I feel like I still have Shadow Step. No, no I Shadow Step the Cobalt Miner at the start of the game, right? Whoa, Drilly! Yo, why the fuck is... I was like, man, Drilly is looking... Kind of large there, right? <laughs> um, okay. This will give me all of them except for this. Oh, the canary. I love the canary. Bye, bitch. I want to attack now. Draw a card. Oh, there he is. Finally shows up. We'll just do this. Oh, my God. That's a that seems like a really good card to get. And then we can do this. And it's a 6-6. Six, six. Holy moly. Divine shield seems really strong. Do it there. We've seen both of the poison boys. We have this in case like, things get a little too hasty on their side of the thing. I don't really care if they kill. Wow, they just shoved it at that. All right, good thing I kept Yogg. Yogg goes hard here for sure. 
dog goes insane. I guess we can see if I can get lethal here first though, right? Let's do this. Um, hmm. Bite over me is slightly better, I guess, but not really. I kind of, I guess the crop rotation is fine. Let's see what this does. Uh, I am going to go face first just in case Yogg has a little bit of too much fun. I feel like this is a full clear though. Oh! Oh! The nuts! The nuts! Oh my god! Just get out of my game, bitch! And I misplayed on turn three! Nice! Wow, feels good, bro. Feels, feels great. Another death knight. That thing is so popular, man, my God. But I guess that's a really big win for Hearthstone. I, I'm a little annoyed seeing it so consistently, but I can't be mad at the team for making a class that people really enjoyed. I don't know if I keep this. I don't think I ever want to throw it back because it might just be relevant. It might just sit in my hand. Oh my God. I was going to say, I don't want to keep this because I think from pit stop, I'm always guaranteed to take this card, but I'll just, I'll just go fuck myself. I'll just go fuck myself. It's fine. Uh, I guess I'm going to coin it. It's kind of depressing because I kind of want this card not in my, but whatever. It's fine because I could have gone prep that and then it would have been so beautiful and I would have been the coolest kid in my high school for sure, even though I haven't gone to high school for like 10 plus years, which is despair, to be honest. But whatever. You know what I mean? I will say, I think from like a viewer standpoint, signature cards aren't like the greatest, but I'm really glad I got this one because I do think it looks really nice. Some of them like really shine, and I think this one like really encapsulates the um, the showdown in the Badlands one. I'm not really excited for the ones for this expansion. I don't know why. They're all like boomified. Is that the word? Like they all look like they're robotic. And I'm not sure if that's what I really want from my Hearthstone signature cards. I think what this is, I'll hold it. Uh, no, I'll just put it up. All right, so that's all my backs. That's awesome. Really glad that this card's in my deck if I just drew all my backs. You know how unlucky that is, to be honest? And it's all because I kept this bitch. <laughs> it's so stupid. Ah, upsetting. Wow, that was the most... That guy just did the, basically what I did last game, but arguably even sadder because he didn't get the thing. Oh, my God. See, this is why I kept Zilliax because I feel like it's just a good card. Yeah, see, that's not good. Um... So this will give me two and then I can prep it if I need to. Okay, I'm, I'm okay with prepping this. It makes this worse, but we'll get there eventually. If they want to kill, they can kill it. Whatever, no big deal. Man, it'd be unreal if Sonya could copy the Zilliax. That's like the ultimate dream. It'd be really, really nice. Really? We're going to trade with those. I'm a little surprised on that play. Me personally. I would have just inted um, the the bots there, but because they would have got more corpses for this, me personally. But no, it's fine. Okay, is there any way I could like do this? Things aren't looking good, boys. This guy looks really scary. I could do this, bounce it. That's eh, probably okay. It's not my favorite play in the world, but just to survive. Just to survive, because that means if they want to play more minions here. Okay, wait, so I can go coin this. No, I don't. I can't coin that. I need him to do like a better, a different play here. Can you like play some more stuff? He knows I have it. So if I play this, this goes to this will go down to four, but this one goes down to three. So I need to play two more minions. We'll be waiting for a hello. Robert, we're waiting for Christmas, bro. If not for another like, okay. <laughs> he knows I have the Zilliax too. Ooh, this is interesting. Okay, let's go for a Spicer play here. I'm gonna see if I can get it. If I could draw a pirate here. That'd be pretty sick. Hey, Pog Champ, we actually drew a pirate. That's not a fucking pirate game. <laughs> I have to play this, right? Which is so sad. I'm so depressed. But I feel like dying is bad. Generally speaking, dying's not great, you know? You don't want to die. I get four more life from this, I can. Bro, this card is so good. Ah, uh, and I have to kill it. I guess I get the life back though, which is good. 
I'm I'm just happy that this card was played before this card. It's, it's, it's just so spooky. Okay. How do we do this, gamers? I need to play this, I think. And then maybe we got a card that answers this. I don't think there's an elemental that like desperately I'm looking for though. But I feel like it's always this first. And we can we can easily do this. That's a big boy. That's just gonna die next turn. I need to, I need to answer this. This makes me depressed. But I don't think there's a way I can do it. Hmm. Yeah, it's looking a bit cooked because I didn't have an answer to this. Now I do see the out, and it's as simple as just playing for Reno next turn. That's the uh, that's the true gamer status right there. Can I draw it? Let's find out. Wait, why are we trading? Oh, I see why. Okay. It's okay. I think. I don't think actually. Wait, why are we trading? What? Why was I expecting something so much different there? I think that was a pretty mediocre turn. If that's it, I'll take it. Nice. That's not it. Shit. Wow, that was that was really bad. Oh wait, never mind. I forgot they got poisonous. Hey Reno, I'm the best player ever. Oh. Does anything save me here? Not yet. Let's peek around here. Those those don't do anything, unfortunately. Okay. You got me? That's not it either. I mean, technically speaking, I'm not dead. Smile. Right? Freeze that so like they can't get more poisonous. I feel like I'm still dead here, but maybe there's a chance. Again, the Reno off the top saves my life every fucking time. Uh, maybe we get lucky enough to grab it. I don't think there's another card unless I can get the last excavate. Oh, wait, he's not trading. That's or not going face. That's good. Hey, Reno, 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 Reno. He doesn't hand buff either. Like, there's nothing I'm really like that nervous for. We can win this. Rob looks like he doesn't really have a great hand. Oh shit. Sorry, bro. I didn't know your game. Reno. Oh my god, this Reno's gonna hit. This Reno's so good. It's so delectable. It's so juicy. Watch and learn. I am the best. Here we go. It's not. It's not Reno. Um. Um. Yeah, it's uh, it's looking like I'm dead. Oh, I do have a pirate. Nice. Ah, uh, that's a shame. Too far off. GG's, bro. GG's. Uh, I just couldn't answer the Prime Walker or whatever the fuck. This card's fast enough, and we've been fine. Yeah, this deck's probably not worth climbing, but is it a good time? Absolutely. Highlander Rogue has always been just a really, really good time. Really, really enjoyable. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one.